Ladies and gentlemen, we're set to go with our next bout of the evening, scheduled for three rounds in the 125-pound weight division. Chris Wagner is your referee. Introducing first, fighting of the red corner, she wears white with gold and black trim. She weighed in at 124.6 pounds. Her record, four victories against only one defeat. She represents ITC Training Center, fighting out of Astoria, New York, Grace Avine. Avine. And her opponent across the ring, fighting out of the blue corner. She wears camouflage with black trim. She weighed in at 124.6 pounds. Her record, three victories against three defeats. She represents Henzo Gracie, fighting out of New York City, Danielle Rind. Rind. Ariel Agami ringside with Phoenix Carnavale at the Broad Street Ballroom. This is Friday Night Fights brought to you by Mohegan Sun Resort and Casino, and this should be a good one. Two impressive amateur ladies matching up. Grace Avian in the white taking on Danielle Rind in the fatigues and black. Yeah, she didn't even want to touch gloves. She just wanted to go right to it. Avine coming in at four and one. Rind at three and three. Danielle Rind originally from Seattle. Now fights out of New York at Henzo Gracie Academy. Grace Avine from Ireland. Early first round action here. Avine and Rind in the clinch. A full rules amateur affair here. Round one of a schedule three. Avine five foot eight. Height advantage over Rind, who is five five. And again, you see they have the amateur elbow pads, so you know there will be elbows thrown, or a few short elbows in that exchange earlier. Avine almost has Rind in a headlock there. And Chris the Cannon Wagner, our referee, will break him up. See if Avine tries to use her length advantage here. Set the tempo as she teeps Rind backwards a bit. Now Rind tries to respond in kind. That's the halfway mark of round number one. Avine in white out of ITC Astoria. And Rind in the fatigues and black representing Henzo Gracie. She's a necktie here. She's tying up her arms. She uses a foot to create a block, to create distance. Elbow over the top by Grace. Rin trying to chop down with that elbow. Final 10 seconds of round number one. And the two fighters continue to get tangled up as Avine comes at Rin with the elbows. Now Wagner is just giving her a little bit of a warning towards the end of that round to avoid hitting the back of the head. So Grace Avine, we see right there. And Danielle Rind, oh there she is. Avine comes in with a four and one record. 27 years of age. Want to say hello to her friends and family back in Dublin and County Roscommon in Ireland, representing both of those places. So I want to give proper due to both, both groups of people, all of her fans back in Ireland, as well as here in the States. Danielle Rind, a native of Seattle, her father David Rind is in the crowd watching tonight at the Broad Street Ballroom, so hello to David as well. Joe Sampieri giving Rind some instructions here. Rind a three and three mark. Trying to get over the 500 mark, and Avine looking to prove to five and one, Avine Fought just a month ago here on Friday Night Fights as round two comes underway. Aveen beat Maggie Wanick by unanimous decision in a three-round affair as well here at the Broad Street Ballroom. Nice shot by Rind as Aveen came back around after the spinning back kick try. Rind took her legs out from under her. Under her. Excellently timed by Danielle. Big head kick that lands by Danielle. Big shot up top by 
Danielle Rill, Rind out of the Emerald City. Tries to go back there. Again. See if Avi makes the adjustment here. When Grace goes for the clinch, she winds up putting Danielle in a headlock. St. Pierre giving her, giving her a little advice earlier to try to find her base with her legs so that she can't be thrown off balance so easily. Grace fainting with those knees, tries the body kick. Nice teep by Danielle. Grace is definitely very hard to fight. You know, she stands in an awkward position. That's the halfway mark of round number two. Avine in white, Rind in the fatigues, and Black. Right hand pushes Rind back towards the ropes. See her. Rin doing a better job of keeping her base, keeping her balance. Both these ladies trying to land some elbows in the clinch and now trying to knee each other's thighs. And she's got her dominant position, she's got her arm trapped. And beautiful, she finds Grace off balance and dumps her to the canvas. Final 10 seconds here of round two. Avine coming forward, Rin locking her up, looking for the elbows inside. And round number two comes to a close. So Danielle Rind making her presence felt. To let everybody know we're heading right back to Lucky Strike on March 31st when Jeffrey Dan will take on Matteo Maldonado. So we're going to grace Avine out of Ireland, taking on Danielle Rind out of New York by way of Seattle, Washington. AV in the ITC Astoria product. We've seen her on multiple occasions on Friday Night Fights, as we mentioned earlier. The last time was just a month ago when she beat Maggie Wanick. There's Danielle Rin from the Pacific Northwest, now a New Yorker. And she's got the New York crowd behind her. Henzo Gracie always getting a large amount of fan support. Saw the mayor, Elijah Clark, over there. <laughs> Yeah. In the corner of uh, Danielle Rin, so a lot of big timers on hand to support their fighter. Here we go with round three. This one's definitely hanging in the balance right here as Avine comes out and sends Rin down to the canvas. Yeah, she's able to throw her off balance there. She's kind of over, tries to overwhelm Danielle. Danielle doing a good job of clinching up here. Avin trying to work out of the headlock and come down with an elbow. Yeah, she's using the necktie. She, what she's doing here is she's doing a good job of when when Grace tries to control with the knee or cross the knee over, Danielle takes great advantage of it by using her own knees to throw her off balance. Good movement by Danielle. Avin tried the elbow over the top and Rind avoided it and landed some shots of her own. Third of three rounds here between these two amateurs, a full rules affair. Avine in white, Rind in the black and green. Yeah, Grace throwing some good knees on the inside. Avine with the height advantage here of three inches. Rind has been crowding her for the entire bout. Rind trapping her arm. Wagner breaks him up. Less than a minute remaining here. This is Friday Night Fights brought to you by Mohegan Sun Resort and Casino. These two up and coming amateurs coming down the stretch here. Yeah, both fighters exchanging these. Danielle going for the necktie. Not squared up to Rin, so those knees not landing flush. Now she's trying to stick in a couple of extras here. Yeah, she's using the outside knee. Chris Cannon letting them work. She has a dominant position. As you can see, she has the head control. She's staying very active by continuing to knee. And Ooh. there is the bell. So Danielle Rin really did what you have to do against a taller fighter. She came inside, didn't allow Avine to get those long legs extended. A lot of those elbows were glancing blows. And Rin Dirt certainly took her share of punishment in this fight, but she seemed to just 
from what we saw, she seemed to be kind of controlling the pace in there, Phoenix. She definitely controlled the pace. Uh, she didn't get stressed out in the clinch. She was able to find the dominant position each and every time. She learned from the first round. She was able to throw her opponent off balance. So she was able to deal with Grace's long reach as well, and she was able to land shots by mixing up her combinations. Avine talked to her at the weigh-in yesterday. Very nice young lady, and she was very aware that Danielle Rind would be a tough, a tall order for her, and we'll see who comes out on top in this one. Here's David Diamante. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we go to the judges' scorecards. Judge C scored about 30 to 27. Judges A and B scored at 29 to 28. All for your winner by unanimous decision, Danielle Rind. So Danielle Rind from Seattle, Washington, with her dad in the stands here at the Broad Street Ballroom, makes her presence known on Friday Night Fights a unanimous decision victory over the talented Grace Avine out of Ireland. Nice job by Rind as she improves to four and three. Avine falls to four and two. This is Friday Night Fights brought to you by Mohegan Sun.